To your sun and moon, emulated the direction you tongue twisted, tied and bound. Scrape my tender heart up off the ground. So I stick to stalking every step you're walking. Who drop and roll, mission control. Your wife and daughter should be cold water, but I'm unaffected by restraining orders. You see, I just can't lie. I'm a prisoner for your big brown eyes Don't fear I only love for you All I wanna say to you is My name is My name
funny, I want to say, Ottawa! But I can't really because there's so much more than Ottawa here. Thank you so much for joining us here live from Ottawa at the National Arts Centre presented by Ashe World Fest. I am so honored to be playing for you tonight with these amazing, amazing, amazing musicians. So let me introduce you to, let's walk over here, Mr. Steve Boudreaux on the keys. I know you're clapping at home, maybe screaming very loudly. There are some people here. One, two, three, four, five. There are five people here. <laughs> we have people here who work here. But other than that, it's just us and you at home. Maybe in your car. I hope you're not driving. On the drums, put your hands together. Make some noise for Mr. Jose Hernandez. On the bass, please put your hands together for Mr. Soul Keys himself. He goes by the name of Kaylin Penny. And just in case somebody sent you this link and you're watching this video either now live or years from now, and you lost the little sheet of paper who told you who this was. My name is Kelly Lee Evans. And I'm so happy to be here with you tonight. Here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Don't you want to know? 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 You guys ready? We're gonna be performing music for you tonight from pretty much all of the songs, the, all of the, the albums that I've put out over the years, uh, especially from my new, new EP, Green Light. Um, but first we're gonna bring you back to an album called I Remember When.
wish you were here truly <laughs> but this is I have to, this is like this is the first time I've done some of these songs in a very long time it's the first show back at the National Arts Center I think since January yes maybe no since December 2020 well I don't know it's been a long time for a lot of us to be making music and uh Ah, you know, I'm thinking back, like my first, my first like real set of concerts were actually here and they were for an album I did called Fight or Flight. We're not doing any music from that one, sorry. But um, it was in 2006 and I have a huge love for this space, this space that is located on the unceded territories of the Algonquin Anishinaabeg peoples. Uh, so so happy to be here. You can't see outside. This is Ottawa. This is a beautiful, beautiful city. If you could look out these windows, you would see a beautiful, peaceful street. And we are so honored to be here uh, celebrating our beautiful, beautiful city and this beautiful building. And this space and this music, I can't wait to play more songs for you. I hope you can feel how excited I am. OK, let's move on. <laughs> Broken wishes, 
Is all right at home? No, you're not good girls either. This next song is from an album that I absolutely love. And this is a song that I love to perform every time because it describes how I want to feel every single day of my life. It's called Feeling Good.
Vetching the same, you know how I feel. A river running free, you know how I feel. Last I have a treat, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new love. I am so, so happy. Yeah, that's it really. <laughs> but I'm also so happy to be able to play these new songs for you. Um, when Claudia and Yasemina came to me and we talked about doing this show, I don't even think I had envisioned uh, this album yet. And then it bubbled up and it became the feature of this evening. So tonight we are celebrating music from my new EP, Green Light, which you can order from Bandcamp. And um, all proceeds go to me. 
and whoever I choose to give them out to. Yes. Um, oh, yeah, and I, oh yeah, we started the Feed Cyrus My Cat campaign. So proceeds would go to Feed Cyrus the Cat and my children. Yes. Awesome. This next song is, uh, is dedicated to my friends who tell me that they love this song and play it every day, and uh, they know who they are. Shakura. And, um, <laughs> and I can't wait to, uh, and, and Amanda. And um, yes, so these songs are, this, these few songs especially are for you. Yeah.
gonna be very hard. you guys doing out there? All's well? We ha used to have people here. <laughs> there they are. <laughs> oh man, what a time we're living in. But I think one of the most amazing things about music is that you can write the songs about any time in your life and yet the themes still keep coming up or they still fit a new situation. Um, probably because I'm still, I'm not the same me. I'm really not the same me. But I remember writing this song after my first accident. Some of you may not know, but in 2013, I was hit by lightning. It's a strange story. I'll tell you about it sometime. Um, and then I think I wrote this song after that. And then, you know, I went out to tour this album, which was an album called Come On. And uh, at least I intended to tour that album. And the night before the album came out, I fainted and hit my head. And I was off from life, it felt, for two years. And, um, and I remember thinking, you know, wow, I really cannot make any plans. <laughs> like, you cannot plan anything, right? You really can't. Um, you can, but wow, do you have no control over most of your plan, mo any of your plans really. I mean, try to dress a child to go outside, a baby, you know? Right, so this song is really all about that realization that I had that I really just needed to let go and accept what was c coming into my life if I wanted to, to, have, to make peace with what was happening. It's called Hands Up. Keep coming and all is as it should be. I 
not so close, but not so far. Just show me who you really are. So I like to get to know you better. I just read your thighs, and I'm fascinated by your tender smile. And I like to think of Cause from this life I want more So I like to get to know you better I just realize that I'm fascinated by your tender smile And I'd like to take a moment so that I can hear your mind Cause I know that I'm so happy. I hope you can feel that. I hope that for every minute of this concert, you have felt our love. Another night of quiet room.
Absolute amazing time. That was theoretically our last song, but you are not. That's the saddest encore call ever. <laughs> that was pretty awesome. But wait, the people calling for an encore are the most amazing team here <laughs> at the NAC. It's odd though, because you'd think they'd want to go home, but they work late nights, a lot of nights, and they are amazing. Instead of spending time with their family, they spend time with the many musicians that grace the stages. And they're like sound and stage crews all over the world who have been affected by this time that we're living in. And you tuning in tonight is amazing. And when you can start coming back to shows, please do so that these people can continue to work and bring you more and more live music. You can't see them, but wherever you are, I want you to thank Peter, I want you to thank AD, I want you to thank Jeremy, and I want you to thank Dave. They are amazing. They're clapping for themselves right now, which is so sad. But I know they can hear you clapping at home. <laughs> yes. And I really want to thank the team at Ashe Music Fest. Ashe World Music Fest. I love you guys. Thank you so much for doing this for us. We love you more. We should just stop here. If you're not going to win, I love you more. Thank you for having us. And Ming, thank you so much for taking photos wherever you are. And um, gosh, I just have to thank, well, I have to thank the NAC. I have to thank the Algonquin Anishinaabe people for letting us live, work, play, and love on this amazing land. I think my amazing city, Ottawa. I love my country, Canada. This is the best place ever. I love this place. And I'm so thankful to play with everyone here. And uh, yeah, let's, let's pretend we're leaving. And then we'll come back for our encore. This, <laughs> this next song, Shameless, that's what's called Shameless. Um, this next song is, it's a song that I've been, I, you know, people say to me all the time, they're like, Kelly Lee, how are you doing? And I'm like, really, really good. And I don't think they think I'm being serious, but I really, I, I am doing really well. And it's because, you know, when I wasn't performing for venue, because people like the NAC were still having music. And even if, like the last live streamed concert you saw of mine was probably two years ago. It was a, well, yeah, two years. It was a Christmas show in the same room. And before then, they did another show with RBC, 
um, Blues Fest. I would, like it was a drive-in theater, a uh, drive-in festival. And then before that, they had these live streamed concerts for all of us. So, so many of us have had the opportunity to continue to play because people still keep programming music like a Shea World Fest. And I am also, I've been so lucky to be out there speaking and, and telling my story to so many different people. And one of the things that I do after I, I speak is I sing this next song and it's a song that I dedicate to everybody because I feel like if we're still here, that means it's because we're unbreakable so far. Mm. Oh, thanks, guys.
<laughs> we got one more for you guys. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Thanks, Peter. This man has always made me feel so welcome. He's like my godfather, my sound godfather, my lighting godfather. And um, thank you, Peter, for always making me feel like this place is home. This is like late night. 
Mercury Lounge. Thank you so much. We love you. We really do. Take good care. <laughs>